It's another Jubal phone tap. 107.3 KFFM. Medical Clinic, this is Desiree. How can I help you? Hi there. My name is Adam, and I had an appointment with Dr. the other day. Yes. So I, I was transferred to you because they said that you're the nurse who works with him? Uh, yes. Okay. So he suggested that it was time for me to get a colonoscopy. Okay. So the reason I wanted to talk to you is because I have a kind of a problem with that. It just seems so invasive and so uncomfortable. I understand a lot of people have hesitations and reservations about it, but I will say that I haven't had anybody tell me that it's outright painful. Yeah, but I don't know how to say this. Um, I heard they put something up your bottom. Yeah, that is what happens. Ooh. But it, it shouldn't be. I mean, look, if you really need to, we can put you out for the time that it's happening. Oh, you can knock me out for it? Absolutely. You won't feel anything. Oh, okay. That makes it a little better. So can I request to be punched in the face then, please? Um, with a board would be nice, too. I can be hit with a board if that's possible. Um, are you are you joking? No. I mean, you said that they could put me out, so I was just thinking, like, the best way. A punch in the face would be nice or some sort of heavy board. I'm sorry. That's not what we do here. Um, nobody's going to hit you in the face or with a board. Um, oh, Actually, we'll have an anesthesiologist come in. And... Right, and he can, just, he can just punch me or hit me with something. It's, I like it, um, especially if you're going to be fooling around back there. I mean, that would make things better. There's no kicking or punching or anything involved. Hmm. It's just a needle. So, wait, okay. How is him hitting me with a needle going to work? Is it just a super heavy needle? Wow, okay. Um, you really have not been to a lot of doctors before, have you? No, but, I mean, I've paid a lot of money to have people hit me in the face before, so that's why I perked up. I was like, this is great. Well, I tell you what. How about when you schedule your appointment uh -huh. to, to come in, we'll review any questions that you may have at that point. Okay. Well, I'm actually, you know, I'm, I'm in the neighborhood, uh, so I could just drop by a sample in the next 15 minutes. A sample of what? Oh, well, what you want to look at. Like, I had a big lunch, and I'm, like, thinking about it. Why should you guys do the hard part of having to poke around when I can just uh, give it to you? I appreciate that, but that's not exactly how the procedure works. Uh -huh. So is a Ziploc or foil more like a better way to okay. preserve it? Neither. So if you would just please not drop off any fecal matter at our office. Oh, no. Hey, look, you're not putting me out of my way at all. No, 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 please. I can, uh, it's it not be... a problem. No, really, it's, it is. Well, no, no, it's, it's not a problem. I know you're worried about my time and everything, but I'm not doing much. No. Just holding this thing in, that's all I'm doing. No, it's not. It's genuinely not an issue about your time. We just don't accept feces in our office. Yeah, but I'm not a stranger. I have an appointment there for, you know, colonoscopy. It's not like I'm a weirdo, <laughs> like, like I'm just showing up with it. I mean, you guys want it anyway, yeah? Um, we don't want it. Uh, that's not really it. Oh! Uh, I'm sorry? Oh! Oh, what? Well, I just, I was holding on and I just sort of lost it. Oh, my God. Yeah, yeah. So I can just bring it by now, then. Sir, uh, you are not allowed to do that. Okay. And I need to get off the phone right now. Okay, well, am I allowed to do a prank phone call on you? I'm so What? Am I allowed to do a prank phone call on you? And I'm asking because this is actually Jubal from Brook and Jubal in the morning doing a phone tap on you and your coworker Dana set you up. <laughs> it's a joke. <laughs> she told me that you always get weird calls transferred to you about awkward medical situations and she wanted to mess with you. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I enjoyed that, but now I've definitely got to go take a shower. That was awesome. <laughs> well, you handled it all in stride, you know? It sounds like you get a lot of weird calls like that. <laughs> uh, not quite like that. <laughs> Jubal Phone Chaps. Catch him every weekday with Brooke and Jubal in the morning. 107.3 KFFM.